Hey yo, currently on my break. I think I've had too many spicy fucking noodles. And uh, today I thought what I'd do is explain to you why I talk like a fucking stereotypical black man sometimes. Like a stereotypical black man, not just any black man, because it's racist, you know, but like a stereotypical like gangster, you know what I'm saying? Like, yo, what up boy, let's go boy, you know, like, and I think one of the, okay, there's two reasons, and one of the reasons is because when I was little, I used to be a mad gamer, like a hard out gamer, right? And I used to play this game called uh, SAMP, so San Andreas Multiplayer, so that's Grand Theft Auto San Andreas multiplayer, right? And I would, and there were like servers and stuff where you can, uh, where the main objective of the game is to be, is to role play. You know, if you've ever heard of role playing in the bedroom, <laughs> you know, like role playing. And I would role play as a gangster, you know what I'm saying? So I would have to type out how I would talk as a gangster. So, and you know, I just spent countless hours playing that video game. It was fucking awesome. I mean, like I, I role played as other things as well, like um, an Asian guy, a white guy, but it was never as fun because you know, when you're a gangster, you can just okay. I'm gonna stop saying very much because you know it's gonna be racist. It's gonna sound racist, but point of the objective is I used to play the video game a lot and I role played as a gangster, so the lingo kind of stuck with me. And the second reason is because. <clears throat> When I watch these videos, like I watch my own videos, because you know I'm fucking you call it what you want, but I watch my own videos, right? And I notice at the early beginnings, when I when I kind of just talk normally and I'm kind of just myself, um, the content and my character, my videos, it, it seemed kind of dry, you know, it seemed kind of monotone, it seemed kind of boring. So, what I've made an effort to do is animate my voice, animate my character, animate my personality so you know I'll just fucking rah, just fucking yell at you sometimes to keep you hooked, to keep you interested in the video and I find that it's so much easier and so much you know better to throw on like an American accent and like say a meme because that's so much more animating, that's so much more contrasted to you know my current personality, my current accent so like say if you're like American you wouldn't probably imitate someone in, Amer in an American accent, you know, you would probably do it in like a British accent or an Irish accent because it's different from how you would normally talk. So it, it seems and it feels more animated, it feels more different, you know, more alive. So when I'm talking in my New Zealand accent and then I suddenly bust out like this African American, you know, like, yo, what up, boy? You know, it's so much more different from, yo, what up, boy? You know, like, it doesn't sound as cool, you know, it doesn't sound as effective. So. Yeah, so pretty much, I'm gonna get back on my fucking, I need to bust out my fucking work shift right now. I'm, break time's almost over, but hey, hope you enjoyed this video. That is exactly why I sometimes talk like a stereotypical black man. Hope you enjoyed the video, and uh, I'll see you when I'm naked. Peace out. Hey there, pal. Um, as you can see, I entered the most ugliest hat here of all time competition, and I think I'm gonna win. Uh, but hey, hey, that ain't the point. That ain't the point of right now. The point of right now is for me to welcome you to day 76 of the cold shower streak. Let me present to you the quote of the day, which is, if there is no enemy within, the enemy outside can do us no harm, you know? If you, are, if you, if you accept yourself, if you don't give a fuck, people can't do anything to you, honey. Yep, peace out.